something's on my mind. I thank you for the invitation to your camp. It's, um, well appointed, not too crowded, perfect for thinking, and I've been doing just that. It's about Wolbrin. We know he's been taken to Moon. The problem is this. A preponderance of evidence that I am a terrible adventurer. I'm not sure I should trust Wolbrin's fate to, well, me. Hmm, you've done so much already. I'm hesitant to prevail upon you again, but I can't risk recapture. I barely escaped last time. You'd do it then. You'd look for him. That's <clears throat> very decent of you. Thank you. There's something else you should know. Something I can no longer ignore. I know you've learned about the gnome's pursuit of rune powder, but do you know what it truly is? That myth has come to life. The Iron Hand gnomes have proven the impossible. Rune powder is real, and they have it in their possession. That myth has come to life. The Iron Hand gnomes have proven the impossible. Rune powder is real and they have it in their possession. Destruction, the only thing it's good for. But destruction of what? Well, I'm hoping Wilbrin will be able to tell us. I shouldn't have let him drift away. Shouldn't have let that lot get their claws into him. Now more than ever, I need to find him. We need to find him. He's the only one I might be able to speak to sensibly. I'd kiss you, but neither of us deserve that. Thank you. I haven't been there myself. The area around it is, well, cursed. Terrifyingly so. I did hear something interesting, though. There are shades that plague the path to the towers. Shades that fear not steel, but light. Dwergar, who mentioned it, sounded truly traumatized. It's almost amusing. Like what? Alchemist, tinkerer, adventurer, Curmudgeon? <laughs> I wear many hats. Most with great enthusiasm. Thank you for noticing. Barkus Root is my name. Baldur's Gate is my home. Back in the city, I offered my expertise to the highest bidder. I was quite popular, too. <laughs> I'm not picky about my customers. I suppose I... I suppose I'd be very, very sad. Then, after a while, I'd find whoever killed him and put a smoke powder bomb in their trousers. <laughs> <laughs>